Are they guys? Oh yeah, it's you guys again. That was hand can seven. This is part. I'm sorry about my rudeness. <laughs> obviously, it's hand can seven, and this is my third video. Obviously, the Sly Cooper um, uh, episodes and walkthrough, all that stuff. And obviously, I'm gonna go to high class heist or hist or heist, whatever it's called. Oh, I wonder what this. Oh, I love this level. It's not as good as the book one though. Um, if I remember correctly, back in my childhood, my brother obviously had the game, well, rented it actually. Um, high class, I, I was just a member, he, he, uh, he'd get into the, like, the library level, so which is the next level, I think, after this. So yeah, I just love it, the rolling past these lasers. Rolling, 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 my dog just went away. It's just not, as, it's not a hard thing to say, but yeah. And obviously that beam there. Oh, I'm, so, I'm in trouble now. I'm in deep trouble, not. Uh, Sly Cooper knows something. He always knows a way. He knows a way out of everything. So I'm gonna take this box out here. Uh, there's a couple of balls here. Nice free ones. Obviously, just smash them as if I'm doing bowling or something like that. Anyway, here we go. So I'm just gonna let's get serious now. Um, so basically, uh, I got a couple more balls left. Uh, well, obvious thing to say. Oh, I hate this part. An analog stick for some reason. So I'm playing this on an emulator for the PlayStation for uh, PlayStation uh, 2. You know, uh, I couldn't like use my uh, what's it called? Um, I can actually go. Uh, what's the word? I couldn't use my right uh, analog stick to whilst move the camera around until I suddenly realised later on that um, I could just fix it. Um, well, I'll fix it later, but you know, I could just fix it during something else, you know, yeah, I'm talking crap about it. Now, here we go, so I'm going to come around here, my analog stick is obviously bothering me because it doesn't work right now. I had to map the analog, what I was trying to say is, I was trying to map the analog stick to like, the right way, so, I'm talking crap. Here comes those sumo wrestlers, obviously those wrestling guys, they like to obviously intimidate me, with their belly flops and stuff like that. <laughs> so, yeah. Well, obviously that bit of flopping is no match for me. Might as well rest look with this one. Yeah. Ah, yeah. If you guys know wrestling, obviously you know him, so yeah. Anyway, here we go. Someone's gonna come up past the lily pad here. Ah, oh, these lasers do not like me at all. They just keep coming at me. It's like a golf and it never stops calling me. So yeah, here we go. Smash. Got the alarm horn. Obviously that silenced him. Smash, it's prime time. Here we go, yep. Took, took those uh, two uh, bottles, obviously. Uh, we're gonna take out the, uh, I'm gonna be careful of these search lights. One of these and I'll just get pissed off and start turning red. So yeah. The eyes over the freaking, okay, that's a bit weird, you know, yeah. Spotlight's the eyes, I'll watch you. They find you, they're gonna alert you. They're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna pay you back and forth, so yeah. So here we go, I'm gonna take these three. Doesn't really matter now, these stupid slips, right? Bang! So I took that slips like out. Now I'm gonna go in the office and take these balls on. Oh, no, I got, I, I got a, a little, little, little uh, joke for you. Not, not. Who's there? Shut up. Shut up, who? Shut up, slime people. That was a badish joke ever. That was a badass joke. And here we go, I can take the key down. Now, obviously, this is obviously. If you like what you see so far, uh, yeah, I took, I obviously cut to the um, um, the machine because I had to go back and obviously go back to this level so I can get the uh, vault. And that's because I'm too lazy to do so, Yeah, obviously so you go all the way back. Who can be asked for that? You know, yeah. So obviously I took out. I wonder what movies could be next. I got the rolling move. I got the. Um, Oh, I don't know, probably the knocking out. I could be wrong. Enough, yeah, I know. Mean, and you can obviously, this move allows you to obviously, if you, it only works for Raleigh's level. If you obviously press the uh, binocular button, and you know, obviously, you can obviously see breakable objects, just like Bentley said. And you can obviously see uh, bottles, but I don't care because I've already completed this level so many times before. It's so annoying, so yeah. I think this thing's showing me that, yeah. Let's uh, roll back uh, to uh, the back in the day in 2001. And obviously Limp Biscuit and everything. Uh, yeah, Fred Dorist. So, yeah. 
the answers are, and the other exits the room, like rolling, 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 rolling. My freaking tongue goes weird. Anyway, here we go. Here's the last. Um, I feel like I've got like one more left. Uh, well, I can't believe it's done that quick. I've got two more left, actually. I've got like two more uh, levels left of Raleigh, well, of this section. The next section will come later, where you'll do the, uh, the uh, what's it called? Uh, the, uh, the, the, uh, the shooting submarine level. I hate that level to move. It's not the hardest level in the freaking game. Then you got, obviously, the other one. Um, yeah, the, uh, I think it's called the gunboat. And then obviously you got Wally, the big boss. He's actually a small guy. Um, big mouth and small action. So, yeah. What I'm trying to say. So, yeah. Small guy, but little action, but you know. So, yeah. Here we go. Here comes the library part. This one reminds me of back in the day when my brother obviously didn't let me on the PlayStation. As long as my sister wasn't allowed on the PlayStation 2, we got this like uh, I think we got to this part here. Yeah, we did. So, yeah. I'm gonna enjoy this. Those rats got completely slaughtered, massacred. Well, these are the shooting dudes. Wait a second. What if I jumped into that barrel for protection? I don't know. It looks pretty risky. Pretty massive. Splat. Only one way to find out. Bang. Look at this. Watch this. Completely. The skin threw darts at me. I just ate it up. Oh, another cool thing. Is obviously, if your barrel goes on. Well, I like this because it's the PlayStation 2. That is not PlayStation 1. If your barrel goes on fire, it stays all crispy and all burnt up and stuff like that. Obviously, I didn't do it in this playthrough, so you know, yeah. Here we go. Look at this. Bang! That's pretty cool, isn't it? A very good move of me. It was a very good move of me. So, yeah. Here we go. This uh, Watch this guy. He's going to get it hard. He's going to get he's gonna get destroyed. He's going to get slaughtered. He's annihilated. Wrecked. Bang! Look at that. Sick. You know, here we go. So obviously the uh, basically just collect bottles, that's all we're doing, it's a gameplay loop, so yeah. In other words, you do it throughout the game, over and over again. Oh, it's such a good game. Uh, pretty much good. Alright, got a couple of bottles, got nine bottles left. Oh, actually, what am I saying? Got 20, well, 11 bottles left, so yeah. You can do the math. So yeah. Oh, I just can't get that ball. Just can't resist getting that ball. So yeah. Alright, bang! Got it. So now I'm gonna walk the barrel all the way. Okay, I've gotta get this life first. Now I'm gonna walk the barrel all the way to the uh, elevator. Play some uh, nice chilling elevator music. Oh, sorry guys. My uh, iPod and my iPhone oh, were very old fashioned. Well, this game obviously, when this game probably came out, you probably had the CD players where you put the CD in and then you listen to the music, you know. Old guys obviously in the house know what I'm talking about. Oh, elevator music. Let's just play some Mozart and stuff like that. So yeah, some nice classical good music. Oh, classical music's so good. So fun when you go in the elevator. So yeah. Most of the elevator music that I was playing, if you guys ever, if you guys into professional wrestling, check out the Vader, uh, you know, the, uh, the wrestler Vader. Well, he's not with us anymore. But, you know. With the Undertaker and the Vader, and when obviously you, you listen to the music I was playing in the background, that was really funny. Obviously, Vader obviously gets very offended because obviously he was like, wrestling's not fake. And obviously, he grabs the uh, interviewer by the top, uh, by his time, obviously, intimidated. So, yeah. And then the music behind it and everything. And obviously, Undertaker was trying to tell him that uh, wrestling is like the finest uh, sport ever. He's not acting. You know what? Shut up. Shut up! Just obviously see the video for yourself, so yeah. So here we go, I'm gonna come and obviously take this guy out. <laughs> What's this guy to do with slow people? Just take this guy out and just completely destroy him. And make him realise that he got he got served, so yeah. Served him up one. A nice whooping. Nice ass whooping. So yeah. Opening can of whip ass. Merit to say that. So here we go. I'm gonna come up here and obviously come up here. Nicely done. Ah, oh, nicely done again. Take these out. Ah, oh, we got five bottles left. So you know, yeah. Also get these five bottles in. 
Ah, uh, so basically, they are. I'm gonna go for these searchlights here. And basically, that's the. Oh, that stupid horn again. Very, very annoying, stupid horn. Ah, uh, basically. Oh, oh, am I gonna fall? Nah, I don't think so. Because obviously, I think these are the last bolts here. Just take these guys out, and then obviously. Get to the uh, machine. I don't need that barrel right now. Once you get, oh, it's, all, it's all the way over there. It's all the way over there, man. Why can't I just be like Superman or Spider Man? Just swing a web and you're over there already. Like some teleportation or first hook shot or something like that. And just connects to the wall. And just jump over there as if I'm Rachel from DOA or something like that. Or more like uh, uh, Ninja Gaiden. Compass, yeah. Ah, oh, 242. Pretty cool. Ah, oh, they both go into each other. Very divisible. So, yeah. I mean, good if I don't have to do maths anymore. I've already done my maths, you know, yeah. I've got English as well. That's got nothing to do with this gameplay play for anyway. This one features Dev Kubarinda's slow motion jumps. Wow, that's a good uh, that's a good ability. I wonder why I could do oh, whatever man. Like I'm gonna use these abilities anyway. <clears throat> oh, don't make don't make it obvious that you're gonna uh, that you stole from there. It makes it obvious. Oh, why? You might just leave your shoe in there. Because I'm surprised. I'll be surprised if these people have this level has a toaster. The slide just oh, what am I talking about? The slide just puts himself in there. And, Freaking spell sprays jam and uh, all the chocolate sauce and the freaking mustard and that and a bit of ketchup and just have a nice baked raccoon. And here we go. Here comes the last part of this level. I'm gonna grab this key and that's it there. And obviously, I'll see you guys later in the part, uh, the next part, which is gonna be part four, five. Bye. Have a nice day.